Hello and welcome. This video is number 7 in a series of short videos detailing the use of Masterframe and Masterframe Pro. In this video, we're going to be looking at the Add Bracing facility within the Create menu. Just like the previously demonstrated Add Column and Add Member in a Panel facility, the Add Vertical Bracing facility is a quick means by which to generate additional general members in a bracing format. Bracing members can of course be added using the general Add Member function however, for speed of generation, the Add Vertical Bracing will speed up this process tremendously. In the Add Bracing, just like the other types of Add Members, we have our Member Attributes. Furthermore, we also have different styles of bracing that can be generated. If we select Cross Bracing, we can change our section type to a flat section. For this example, we will choose a 200 by 12 mm thick flat bracing member. By default with this Bracing Generation command, the Bracing Member option, Release Ends and the tension only attribute is checked. We can also place these bracing members into our different member viewing or member design groups. To generate the bracing members, we simply need to pick two nodes on opposite corners of the bracing bay that we wish to place the bracing members in. If we click on the first node label, this highlights the box in blue to confirm this is the node end we are ready to select for. We can then select the first corner node of the braced bay. Automatically, the second node box is highlighted and we can now select the second node to define the opposite corner of the brace bay. Now we can see the bracing is generated. If we choose a single leg reverse style of bracing, we may decide to choose a different type of member, for example, a circular hollow section. And in this instance, we're going to say that it's not tension only. As for this style of bracing, we would like to take some compression. Again, we're ready to pick the first node. We can also see that we're ready to pick the first node of the braced bay by the tip that's displayed at the bottom of the screen. Again, by clicking on one diagonal corner and the opposite diagonal corner, we can generate this single leg reverse style of bracing. In this particular instance, the direction that we choose the diagonal corners in does dictate the orientation of the bracing. If we undo this step and switch direction to pick the corners from the opposite diagonals, we can see that the bracing is provided in the opposite orientation. This also applies to the bracing type where we have a K bracing within the bay. And finally, to demonstrate, we also can have the inverted V type brace, which will be generated using the same procedure as we use for the other bracing arrangements. This concludes this short video detailing the use of the master frame and bracing member generation facility.